Well, once again today, the state Senate committee on federal and state affairs heard only from those who had bad things to say about making marijuana legal in Kansas. And as Cakes Jackson Overstreet tells us, that prompted one senator to cry foul over the way the hearing has been conducted. For the second day in a row, nine senators sat inside this room at the state house for an informational hearing on marijuana legalization. And again, the testimony was largely negative. I do believe that perhaps one of the biggest threats that we face um, to the quality of life in Kansas is the proposed legalization of marijuana. Thursday's session included testimony from both people in the medical field and state law enforcement agencies who all raised some sort of concern with any potential bill to legalize medical marijuana in the state. Our position on legalizing marijuana, whether it be medical or recreational or whatever you want to call it, uh, and that is, we have been opposed to this since uh, the first efforts to do this came up. Near the end of the hearing, Democratic Senator Cindy Holster brought up the fact that every speaker over the two days had been opposed to marijuana laws. As far as the hearing itself and the process, was this through invitation only? And I'm curious when we're hearing from proponents. The committee's chair, Republican Mike Thompson, says he invited these speakers specifically because proponents have had the chance to speak in the past at other hearings. We had a special committee on uh, over the uh, October and uh, December had four different days uh, where there were proponents in that. So this was allowing the um, side to educate us on some of the negative impacts that we've seen in other states. Despite the sentiment from these speakers, Holscher says a lot of concerns raised over the last two days can be addressed. I think this is my fourth or fifth information session on the topic um, where a lot of these issues and concerns that were brought up have been addressed and answered and bills drafted accordingly. In Wichita, Jackson Overstreet, Cake News on your side. The two medical marijuana bills have been introduced in that committee in the last month, but neither has gotten a hearing.